Hi beauties, so I'm doing a wear test of the new Hourglass foundation in today's video. So I'm gonna jump on my main camera and you guys will see me apply the foundation. So I'm gonna throw on warm almond. Hopefully this goes a lot better than yesterday. Ugh. This is definitely very warm. Ooh. <laughs> Hmm. Okay. Um I don't know. I don't know about it if you guys I don't know. Yeah. Um <laughs> let's just see if this changes in color. I'm not even gonna judge it right now. Looking kind of crazy, but we're just gonna see how it looks once I blend it all out. Honestly. This is, this is hilarious, you guys, like, I don't even know. All right, so this is what warm almond is looking like. I'm just gonna apply concealer and just see what happens when I'm done with my entire face. Okay, so I'm gonna give this foundation like 10 minutes to see if it changes in color, and then I will update you guys on it and how it wears for the next like five or so hours. So I will see you guys on the vlog camera. I think I'm just gonna hang out with you for a little while. Right now I am about to document my snack. I just had some pirate booty, pir pirate booty? <laughs> pirate booty um, popcorn. So I need to document that into my app. I use LifeSum to document whatever I eat. It's really simple. My phone is so dirty. Ooh. So throughout the day I use this app called LifeSum to document whatever I eat. This is the app right here. So you can just scan the barcode of the item like that. And then um, I'm just gonna add that to di diary as a snack. I just want to let you guys know that the foundation did kind of oxidize and it does match a lot better now. I don't know if you guys can tell, hopefully you can. But it does match me a lot better. It doesn't look orange anymore. It just looks like the skin tone instead. So I think this is probably my shade, like, more so than sable so it's been about an hour of me wearing the foundation i got a little bit hungry so i'm about to make my dinner i'm just gonna make a fake taco bowl if you will i have corn i have some black beans i have some salsa from the supermarket and then i have the rest of my trader joe's chicken which is probably like four ounces of chicken so i'm just gonna put all the chicken in here I don't have any cheese, which is really sad. So I'm gonna use a slice of cheese. I know this is so like, it's not okay. The chicken is about 130 calories for the four ounces. The beans is 120 calories per serving, which is half a cup. I'm gonna do less than that though, because I don't really feel like eating that much beans right now. I don't know why I'm doing a lean back. I'm gonna do one fourth of the beans, which would be half of the serving. Measure that in here. You guys, I'm not the best cook ever. Just thought you should know that. You know, I'm just, <laughs> I'm starting out, okay? I'm also gonna do half of a serving of corn, which will put me at 30 calories of corn, 40 calories per four ounces, okay? So we can have this whole thing. Just kidding. I'm gonna warm this up in the microwave and then I'm gonna put it on the salsa. I do have some lettuce I will add to it and I will just put this cheese on there. So that's gonna be my dinner, you guys. Two hours later. So it's two hours of me wearing the foundation. I figured I would update you guys on it. It is still looking really good so far. The color does match a lot better. It does have that slight matte look to it. Like It's not super noticeable. I will do a flash photography test so you guys can see what that looks like. But it's very beautiful on my face. It looks really, really good. And um, yeah, I need to get my kids ready for bed because it's like their red time. So I am going to be testing out the sweat proof claim of this foundation. So we're going to do a quick leg workout. Really, really quick, like 15 minutes. Hopefully we can crack a sweat so we can see if this is the truth. Okay, so I'm done with my workout. This is this is my workout summary. 15 minutes, 97 active calories, 121 total calories. I'm sweating. The foundation is lasting 
through this sweat. Like, it's still on my face. I do have those little beads of sweat on my nose, but it's literally still there. It didn't even budge. I'm gonna dab this off. And, um... I dabbed the sweat off. It still looks really good. It lasted through this uh, little workout. So I think it is sweat proof. I'm gonna say she is sweat proof. She is pretty much transfer proof. And uh, it's definitely long lasting. So <sighs> I think this is a pretty good foundation. My only complaint so far would be the shades. Like I'm not sure if they're like spot on but besides that i really love it and i think this shade is pretty good for me so so i hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video if you enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up comment down below your favorite butt workouts and i'll see you in my next video bye